Hey guys, what's up? Shin0555 here, back playing more Mirror's Edge. Let me just adjust the TV real quick. All right, we're just gonna continue where we left off. And honestly, we'll, there's a very good chance we might beat uh, the game this sit down. So that'd be crazy, cause I just, it, it, we just beat it in two sit downs. That's insane. But um, remember to like, comment, subscribe, share the video. That really helps me out. God, I love this one. Just whoop, boop. You can't do that in the game. <laughs> I love the loading screens because like you just can't do any of that shit in the game. They say you can, but it's all a lie. Okay, we gotta go there. Is this electrified? There we go. Oh, oh, it's all good. That felt real good. Can I? Let's go up here. Again, I think we're going the right way. This game actually does have pretty decent um, level design. Um, whoa! There we go. Who's moving to the roofs ahead? Looks like you're gonna have a fight on your head. There's a bag somewhere. Where are they? Oh, right, aren't they like... Didn't, didn't we die to them last time? Yeah, I think we did. And roll. I wonder if I can, can I jump down. No. <laughs> Can I save time and just like jump to my death? No. I'll try that again. Oh good! See? Look, I did save time. I guess. Ow. Bah! I gotta slow down to- oh, oh! Come on, oh god. I think I got him. Whoa! Whoa okay, that worked out pretty well. That wasn't that bad. Yeah, doing the counter is usually like a really easy, quick way to deal with these guys. But again, I'll, I'll say it again. The combat in this game is just awful. Like it, like it works. It's just not very good. You're doing good. Mom's just a few blocks ahead. Well, well I'm done. Oh. Like it's serviceable. Like it, it works. But like it is definitely not as thought out as like the platforming is. And it's just it gets to the point where it's just like, why'd you even put combat in this game? You could have just made it like a really cool like free running game where you just like get packages and like run but it's like no we need to have this like like crazy story and then it's gonna make you fight all these police and then okay <laughs> just making sure there's a building where i'm about to jump oh i rolled i rolled game you knew i rolled But god, I love the world of this game. It's so, like, it's so, like, visually cool looking. Like, even, like, again, this is a PS3 game. This is from, like, I think 2008? I want to say 2008. I still haven't checked the, uh, the, uh, the oof, again, I, I hit L2. I remember this part. Let's do that again. Yeah. Oh, we're dead. <laughs> we're dead. Ouchie. But again, this game's from like 2008, and it, and it still looks pretty damn good. Whoa. Oof. All right, all right, all right. Oh. 
I gotta say, with wall running, the coolest wall running I've ever seen is in uh, the Legend of Korra. It's in like the first season when they're like when they uh, Korra and um, what's the Firebender guy? Like they sneak into like a Mon's like meeting. Again, this is why I hate the combat. It's so bad. You just like instantly die a lot of the time. I. Oh my god, Jesus. And let's grab it. Oh, we missed it. <laughs> Ooh. But they sneak into like Amon's um like big anti bender meeting. Oh my! And again, you get tapped twice and you die. It's so like the combat is just awful. But anyway, I'm gonna finish my avatar thought here. Ugh. All right, one second. Let me, let me just. God. Okay, I'm just gonna pause the game and I'm gonna talk about my avatar thought. Anyway, they just ran on the wall and they used like fire bending to keep themselves up with their hands. And I was like, that is the coolest wall run I have ever seen, ever. Okay, okay. We slowed down time. I'm gonna wait until it's fucking red. There we go. Piss off. There we go. Oh, I see. Oh, there's the runner. Uh, like, I never. I noticed. I've only ever noticed that uh, last time I played through this game. I never noticed that before. I think you have to go. Yeah, I think. Okay. Is there a bag here? It sucks that, like. Is there one up here? There it is. Oh, come on, game. I want to get the bag. Yeah, I saw that little, like, tattoo. Oof. Whenever you see, like, this symbol right there, it means that there's a, a bag somewhere nearby. See, that's a cool way to do it, too. Like, you put, like, a little, like... Can we, can we get up the wall, please? There we go. Oop. Bend over. Oh. Again, I could never do that roll thing. It's like I always just land straight on my knees, stop, and then, like, roll, which is the opposite of what you're supposed to do. Cause like the rolling's supposed to take the impact off of your knees. Do you dream of an apartment? Not really. Honestly, like my life goals like right now is to like get enough money to live in an RV. I mean, like, a really nice RV, but if I could do that, I'd be so happy. But, uh, especially, like, right now, RVs are super fucking expensive. They're coming down, but they're still, like, super fucking expensive, man. Sucks. Well, like, in an RV, I like this part because you actually get to, like, really run. Oh, right now. And then you gotta go here, and then here. Ugh. See, I remember that. I remember that from my playthrough I just did. And you can actually get over here. Ugh. A little tricky. Oh, but I did get that, uh... There's supposed to be a... A package right up here. But I guess I got it. Yeah, that, that one's pretty obvious. Okay, where do we go now? Oh, there's a red door. 
this just feels right. Let's keep going. Kick that open. Okay, this is where we gotta move it. Get back here! As the level loads. God, this is so funny. I miss PS3 games. I'm playing this on like actual PlayStation 3 hardware. So, uh, you're getting the genuine experience. And also, we're playing on a version 1. Point, uh, Uh, 1.0, so this is like no patch day one PS3 Mirror's Edge. So it's peak. Peak Mirror's Edge. Also, uh, I actually like quit the game, playing the Steam version of the game on this level. Mainly because the game just became unplayable. And the reason... And the... Oof. Ooh, 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 grab it, grab it. Okay, oof. And there, actually, we should go this way. Um, and the reason for that is because, like, I guess the way they did the glass, um, the glass effect would not go away on, uh... Like, different playthroughs. So if you died, the glass would stay, The like, the glass that broke. Um during your like repeated attempts and eventually it would just make the frame rate just die literally like you would be looking at like one frame a second like it was insane it, it made the game unplayable honestly there we go that was nice Get higher, faith. No, Merc. Uh, I don't approve of drug use. And now it's not the time. I'm, like, about to get killed. I always find it funny that, like, how just unreasonable the police are in this game. I mean, like, it makes sense, because, like, it's like in a, uh, you have to wait for this thing to stop completely or you'll just instantly die. Fun fact. I love how, like, the police are so, like, like, so ready to murder you. Like, they literally just got a thing that was like, kill on sight, and they're like, okay. Break the glass, get the gun. Right, we don't need this anymore. And again, like, they have like, a fucking machine gun, dude. A machine gun to handle this one runner. And it's just like, this is completely overkill. Okay, and this is the part where it would just, the frame rate would just tank. Just like. God, that part is so hard. Let's go. No, he could actually still shoot you from here. Oh, let's go. I cannot tell you how many times I had to redo that, that one section. As we just roll off of that thing. I would love to see what this game looks like in third person. I, I would like to see how well Faith's like character model is actually animated. I don't know, is there a, is there like a mod for that? I, I would assume there is. Like a third person playthrough mod of like... Looks like my little friend is back. Like how he didn't actually like go through the door. I don't know, but I think I know someone. And the brightness is just ridiculous. But bam, that was actually probably one of the hardest missions in the game. Especially that last section. I know we like blew through it really fast, but I got like real lucky. Ooh. Hey, Faithy. Nice of you to drop by. With a little bit of persuasion, Wilfern was pretty chatty. Told me about his meeting with the Pope's killer at the mall. And you're thanking me, right? But when I got there, guess who was waiting for me? No idea, Faithy. I just go there for the pretzels. Bad case of the blues. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? No, Faithy. 
me. It wasn't me. <coughs> Besides, if I wanted you dead, don't you think I would have just killed you myself? You're right. A creep like you couldn't have organized. Now, don't be like that. Ropeburn's dead. I'm impressed. It wasn't me. You need to be careful who you hang around with. Oh, I learned that a long time ago. And yet, here we are again. But I'm afraid I'm gonna have to cut this little meeting short, Vicky. Places to be, you know how it is. Try not to get yourself killed. Merc, Merc, you can stop pretending not to listen now. <laughs> What's up? Can you do a search on Perangelo Kruger security? On it. Why do you ask? Been seeing their name around. In Ropeburn's office and somewhere else. Distinctive logo. Getting anything? Mm, just what you'd expect. Alarms, fencing, armored cars, private security. Oh, and they secure our world, apparently. Where are they based? A few offices around town. Just got a new place down near the docks. Give me some coordinates. I'm gonna go check it out. Alrighty. Next level. But, um... Oh, I remember this level too. But again, I think we're on level 6, if I'm not mistaken, and there's only 9 levels in the game. This game is super short. Which I find is weird, because like, I looked at the, uh... Like, how long to beat, and they said this game's about, like, 6 hours, and it's just like... There's no way. There's no way. Okay, oof. Oh, well, we still made it. Oh, I did that thing. I think you could just jump to this. If I'm not mistaken. There's only one way to find out, really. Um, Get that parkour. Get that parkour. Get that parkour. Ah! Oof. Okay, how close were we? We were pretty damn close to dying. All right, I'm sure we could just like walk right up there. It's it's fine. I was about to do a little bit of climbing. Um, oh, there it is. Can I just? Yeah. Up, up, up. Turn around. Jump, jump, jump. <laughs> Again, it's just like, I really, like, it's so sad that, like, this game's, like, combat, like, holds it down so much. Because, again, this game is so, like, if they just focused on the platforming, this would have been an amazing game. Because, like, again, it doesn't even have, like, a cool story, too, you know? Oh, I got snippers. Um, how do we get over there? Is that door red? No. If it's not red, we can't break it. Oh, right, you have to go down here. That's right. How you were supposed to know that? I have no idea. Because again, there's no indication that like, oh, there's actually like a little, little alcove right there. Now there might actually be like an, like an alternate way to whoop, do that, but um, that's the way I found. And I just gotta go up here and there we go. There, now we're cooking. Ooh, that's cool. Alright guys, I'm actually going to end the video here because there's a sniper and we're going to just uh, do our little uh, killing him and then it's going to lead to a little firefight. But um, anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will see you for the next one. Enjoy that slate. It's coming up and uh, we'll do more... Uh, 
parkour stuff next time. All right, guys. Hey, welcome to the pre-record and slate. This is the uh, end section of the video where I just ask you to like, comment, subscribe, share the video one more time. That really does uh, help me out, and I would appreciate it if you did do that. Um, so if you'd be so kind, I would appreciate it. Other than that, you can follow me on all my social. All the stuff is linked in the description below. Uh, so I have like a Twitter, uh, Instagram. I also have a Discord if you want to um, check me out there. Join on the Discord. Fun stuff. Um, yeah, so if you want to contact me one-on-one, -on -one, that's a great way to do it. Um, and if you missed any of the other videos, they're all on the playlist. Other than that, uh, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for making the end of the video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Okay, thanks. Bye. Later.